um, she, welcome back to my channel. So excited that you are here. Thanks so much for clicking on this video. I appreciate you. It's Jody Dunn, my side of the CVS, getting ready to do my Monday CVS haul. If you are new and you just found me, so happy that you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know that you are new right down there. I would love to welcome you to the channel and say hello back to you. And if you are already subscribed, thank you so much for coming back to another video. I appreciate you. So we got some pretty good things happening at CVS this week. We got the Spend 30 back. Yay! Because we had the Spend 40 for three weeks, four weeks. I don't remember. But anyways, per normal, I'm walking into this week with no threshold coupons. I don't get them in my email any longer. I haven't for a long time. Um, and... I don't get them on the bottom of my receipt very often any longer either. So it definitely makes things a little bit more challenging and I'm way pickier with the deals I'm gonna do without those threshold coupons and I know a lot of you deal with the same thing. I have considered, no I haven't, that's a lie. I'm not opening up a new account. I'm like, I'm not. I already have enough accounts. When you open a new account, you're gonna get all kinds of like awesome coupons and some awesome CRTs because it's a newer account. But even new accounts, once they hit a certain point, they go on that, that same rotation that we've all been on for like over a year now where all we get is basically generic CRTs or very little CRTs. So I'm not messing with it. Like it is what it is. And uh, of course, the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna run in and I'm gonna buy something cheap and see if I get a threshold coupon. Last week that did not work. I think the week before that did not work. Um, or maybe the week before I did get it on one out of my four accounts. I can't remember. Anyways, last week I didn't get it on any accounts. Um, so fingers crossed, maybe this week is my lucky week and I will get one. If not, then I'll just do the deals I wanna do and that'll be it. Uh, so let me know if you're excited about CVS. I keep seeing for a while now, like the threshold coupons spend 75 get 15 off boy that's a nice one or spend 80 get 20 off boy that's a super nice one never ever seen those before i would love to get one but i'm gonna just stay over here and be grateful for what i do have in the savings that i uh can get so let me know if you got one of those awesome awesome threshold coupons so i can be excited for you all right let's run into the store if you enjoy this video Make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's go grab some awesome nails. Happy Monday. We are in the CVS getting ready to do a couple of awesome deals. And I went to check out, grabbed a piece of cheap candy, and I, one of my cards got a 10 off of 70. I'm so excited. So the first deal I'm adding to that is going to be the Cover Girl. They are buy two, earn back a $6 extra buck. And I'm gonna go ahead and just grab the $4.99 um, eyeliners. I was hesitating a little because I'm thinking my store must have been sold out of the black for a long time. And I was like, wait, there's four colors. So anyways, I'm gonna grab these two. They're gonna total me $9.98. I'm gonna use these two $3 printable coupons that just came out in our weekend inserts and i'm going to use the three dollar instant coupon that'll drop me down to just 98 cents for these two earning back a six dollar extra buck makes them a 502 money maker we've got avino and neutrogena on a pretty awesome deal it's buy two earn five no four buy three earn 12. this is a tiered deal meaning it won't track you have to do it all in the same transaction these little 2.5 ounce Aveeno Daily Moisturizing Lotion are included and they are $4.49 in my store. I love this size for like keeping one in my purse when I need it. So I'm definitely grabbing these. So these three are gonna be $13.47. And last week on one of my cards, I did get a $3 off 12 on lotion. So I'm gonna use that. I'll pay $10.47 for these three and earn back a $12 extra buck. Makes them free plus a $1.53 moneymaker. And even if you don't have a three off 12, it would make them just a $1.47 for all three. And while we're talking about Aveeno products or Neutrogena products for that matter, 
we do have an Activate Rewards um, gift card promotion happening. I'm not doing this promotion today. Um, I don't even know if this size lotion is included in this promotion. I did not look. But I wanted to touch on this real quick because I've got a ton of comments from people that have done different promotions, maybe similar to what I've done or exactly what I've done at CVS throughout this promotion period. And the, the um, submissions are not going through. And the same thing has been happening to me, only for CVS receipts. My submissions from my Walgreens receipts went through just fine. But I'm getting emails, which sounds very similar to what some of you guys have gotten, that they couldn't find qualifying purchases because of the quality of the picture submitted. And somebody even commented and said they filed a ticket and were told that they used coupons and that's why they didn't qualify. Well, this promotion says nothing about excluding coupons. I did a purchase a couple of weeks ago where I had OGX and Neutrogena um, makeup wipe removers and that got that same email. I submitted it again last night. It got approved. So I'm thinking they fixed whatever weirdness was happening. So if you have receipts that got that weird email, submit them again. I was so happy to see that approval today. And I will leave the link for this um, promotion down in the description box. All right, moving on. So darn excited. We got the spend 30, earn back 10 back, and so happy that it includes the Pampers diapers so I can stock up on some diapers for my grandbabies. I just grabbed some for Violet yesterday from Walgreens. So today, I think I'm just gonna get uh, EJ size. I was thinking of getting one for each, uh, but I'm just gonna go ahead and get two for EJ. So these are on sale, two for 22, and they are included in the spend 30, earn back 10. And I have a $3 off two digital coupon that I'm gonna use for these. And you guys, look at how big my grandbabies are getting. Oh my gosh, EJ is starting preschool this year and I just love his curly hair. And Violet is turning one in September. I can't even believe it. Being a grandma is so amazing. All right, to finish out this spend 30, I'm gonna grab two of the Tide Pods. They're on sale for $5.49. We do have a digital coupon and you can do this all digitally, but I do have some coupons left. They did expire on Saturday, but my store accepts expired coupons. So I'm gonna use these two $1.50 coupons on these. So it'll be $32.98 for these four products. After coupons, I'll pay $26.98 and earn back a $10 extra buck. It's gonna be way better with my 10 off 70 now. I was gonna do this deal even without it though, because I wanted to stock up on some diapers and some Tide Pods for us. If you love the Dawn Power Wash, which I do, but I'm really stocked right now, these are also included in the Spend 30 Earn 10. And we did just get, um, if you've got inserts, a buy one Dawn Power Wash, get the refill for free coupon. And that would double dip with the $1.50 digital coupon that we got. So this might be a good option for you. All right, next to my transaction, I'm gonna go ahead and add the Nexus. These are spend 20, earn back $10 in extra bucks. And my store is starting to carry this line here, which I actually use this product and I really like it. It's $12.99. This mask right here is not attaching when I scan it on the app to the $10 off two digital coupon, but this one is, and this is included in the promotion. So I'm gonna grab this for $6.79. So that's gonna be $19.78 for these two, and I have this $10 off two digital coupon, and $19.78 is close enough to the 98% rule that I'll earn back my $10 extra buck. Makes both of these a teeny little money maker. All right, and the last thing I'm gonna add to get me up to 70 is some degree deodorant. I just had a stockpile sale this weekend, and I sold a bunch of my deodorant. These are buy one, get one 50% off and on promotion for buy two, earn back a $4 extra buck. The price at $7.59 in my store. So I'm gonna grab the degree spray, one women, one men. So these two are gonna total me $11.38. I'm gonna use the paper coupon that just came out in this week's inserts for $4 off when you purchase two. 
I'll pay $7.38, earn back a $4 extra buck, and I have this offer over on Fetch Rewards for $2.50 back when I purchased two. Makes them just 88 cents for both of them. Now we do have a dollar fifty off of one digital coupon that I already know is not going to double dip because I know how the double dip works. Last week I told you guys I got a random $5 extra buck on one of my accounts like some reward. And this week I got a $2 extra buck on this account as like a random reward. I think it said for downloading the app. So anyways, I'm going to use that free $2 in this transaction. Okay, so for this transaction, I have the Pampers and Tide, the Nexus, the Two Cover Girl, and the Two Degree. That totals me $74.12, so I'll be able to use this 10 off 70 that I just got for purchasing a cheap piece of candy, and I printed on the bottom of my receipt. After all my coupons, I'll be left to pay $35.12, but I'm going to use this free $2 extra buck, which will bring me down to $33.12. I'll earn back a total of $30 in extra bucks and submit to Fetch Rewards for $2.50 on my degree. It makes my cost for this whole transaction 62 cents for everything. I am so excited. All right, we're going to do another little transaction. Uh, we got you by Kotex on promotion for spend 15, earn back a $5 extra buck. So I'm going to grab one of these pads for $7.29. Then I'm gonna grab one of the liners for $5.49. And I'm not quite to where I need to be, so I'm gonna grab one of these little ones for $1.99 as well. So these three are gonna to total me $14.77. I have these two digital coupons that are $4 off two that I previously clipped. They don't attach to the little $1.99 boxes, but they will both glitch and come off. Uh, and then I also have a $3 off 12 feminine care. So I'll pay $3.77 for these three and earn back a $5 extra buck, making them free plus a $1.23 moneymaker. And I'm going to go ahead and repeat the cover girl on this card. But this time I am going to grab the mascara. Um, they're $6.49 each. I could get a way bigger moneymaker by getting the pencils again. But I sell these in my stockpile and I am literally all out because... The three stockpiles I've had this summer, all my CoverGirl mascara is gone. So I'm just going to go ahead and get these instead of the pencils. I'm going to use two of the $3 paper coupons and the $3 instant coupon that we all got. And I'll earn back a $6 extra buck. These are going to be a 202 moneymaker. So instead of a 502 moneymaker, it'll be a 202 moneymaker. But I know I'll sell these in the next stockpile sale I have. So I'm going to grab these instead. And I just checked and I actually did get a three off 12 feminine care on another card as well. So I'm switching cards and I'm going to go ahead and do the you by Kotex deal on this card as well. Basically the same products. I'm going to grab um, one of the pads for $7.29, just a different variation. One of the liners, a different variation for $5.49. And then one of the little $1.99. On this card, I also have two of the $4 off two digital coupons and the three off 12. So this, these three, again, will be a $1.23 moneymaker. All right, I think that is going to wrap up my CVS shopping today. So I'm going to go check out. I've got three different transactions to do. Let's head to the kitchen table and go over my final cost. All right, we are back at the kitchen table. <laughs> <laughs> he was looking at me for a minute. Then he laid back down. He's a little depressed today. I'm not going to lie. I am too. The girl started school today. OMG. New school year. It's always so exciting, but it's a little bit sad for me. Like, I just love it when they're home. And Viv started high school today, so she was a little nervous this morning. So that made me nervous because I didn't want her to be scared. I already texted her, and she texted me back that everything's going great. So I can't wait to hear about their day, and I know Clarky can't wait until they get home. So anyways, uh, this was my CVS shopping today. Let's go over these receipts. So incredibly grateful I got a 10 off 70. Um I tried one card, didn't get, I got a 10% off, which I've been getting on the bottom of my receipt every week. And in my emails, I usually get a 20% off. Tried my second card and I got a 10 off 70. So I just stopped there. 
Um, I did end up doing a transaction on another cart as well because I got that $5 free extra buck that I wanted to use. I got that last week. So um, I tested that card too with a transaction and did not get another threshold coupon, but super duper excited that I did get 110 off 70. All right, so I did the household deal, the Nexus, the CoverGirl, and the degree in that transaction with my 10 off 70. So there are my two Pampers, my two Tide, Tide Pods, there are my two degree deodorants, my two CoverGirl, and my Nexus. So I used all of those coupons that I showed you already, the degree coupon, um, the two CoverGirl coupons, and oh, the two Tide coupons. My Pampers Digital came off, my Nexus Digital came off, my 10 off 70, my $3 off of the CoverGirl, and then there's that free $2 extra buck that I got. It didn't say on the app, but when I checked out and it comes up on the screen now, you know, to click what you want to use, it said for downloading the app. I was like, okay, I've had the app downloaded forever, but whatever. I used $15 in extra bucks. That's all I had on this card. And I had a subtotal of $18.12. I brought with me I don't know where my purse is. I was going to show it to you. Um, one of my $15 P&G gift cards from the last promotion we did, which, so glad I noticed this. I pulled it out of my um, purse. I activated my card this morning, pulled it out of my purse to use it in this transaction, and thought, wow, this envelope feels thick. I must have shoved another one of those cards, like condense the envelopes. So I'm glad I didn't throw it away. Uh, so anyways, I thought I only had two more of my $15 Visa cards from the PNG previous promotion, but I actually have three. So I just brought that with me because I knew I didn't have a lot of extra bucks on any of my cards. And so I knew I'd probably have a subtotal if I got a 10 off 70. And so I just used that to pay. So that worked out fantastic. Uh, I earned the $10 extra buck for the Nexus. The $4 extra buck for um, the degree, the $6 extra buck for the cover girl, and the $10 extra buck for spending 30. Then I did um, in a next transaction my cover girl and the you buy Kotex. So there's my little $1.99 liner, my other liners, and um, the two cover girl and the pads. Uh, I used the two cover girl coupons. Both of my digitals on the you buy Kotex came off. There's that free $5 extra buck reward that I got last time. I should have looked on the screen to see if this one said what it was from. A lot of you guys commented that you've been getting, like last week when I said I got this free $5 extra buck and you guys were like, yeah, I got I got something. I got an email from them that um, an online order, they missed crediting me an extra buck. I have never done an online order at CVS, so that's not what mine is from. I'm not sure what it's from, but I'll take the free $5. Um, there's my three off 12 on the feminine care, the $3 for the um, cover girl. And I did have this the 10% prints on the bottom of my receipt every week. I knew it wasn't going to take off hardly anything because I was using coupons and everything. But I thought, well, I'm not going to use it on anything else. So it took off an extra 25 cents. My subtotal was $2.20. I only had a $10 extra buck on this account. So I just paid that balance and I earned back my $6 extra buck for the cover girl and my $5 extra buck for the UI Kotex. Then my third transaction, I did the UI Kotex again and that Aveeno lotion. So there is my UI Kotex, um, the little liners, my three Aveeno, and then my other two UI Kotex. This was all digital. Both of my coupons for the UI Kotex came off, my three of 12 on hand and body lotion and my three off 12 on the feminine care. And I used $14 in extra bucks to pay, had a subtotal of 24 cents. And I earned back my $12 extra buck for purchasing three of the Aveeno and my $5 for the U by Kotex. So let's talk final numbers here. And hopefully that was helpful on what I shared with you on the Activate Rewards for the Aveeno and Neutrogena products. I don't know what the deal is or why we were all having so much trouble. Again, mine was only trouble with CVS receipts. No trouble at all with my Walgreens receipts. Um, but finally, it got approved. So super duper happy about that. 
So I ended up grabbing $130.11 worth of product. I used $29 in extra bucks to pay and had subtotals of $20.56. So I paid $49.56 for all of this. I just showed you $58 in extra bucks that I earned back. So right there, it's an awesome little moneymaker. Then I did submit over to Fetch Rewards and received back the $2.50 from my degree. So I earned back $60.50 from this haul that I paid $49.56. Makes everything free plus a $10.94 moneymaker, which really got me thinking afterwards. I didn't realize it was going to be that big of a moneymaker. And I was like, well, dang, Jody, even without the 10 off 70, you would have had yourself a little freebie because two of your accounts got the, the $2 free extra buck and the $5 free extra buck. So I guess I would have been able to get everything anyways. If I didn't get the 10 off 70, I was planning on not doing the Nexus. I was not going to do the degree, um, but I was going to do everything else if I didn't get the 10 off 70. And the, the Nexus in the degree just helped me get up to 70. Plus, I do love that Nexus product, so I was super happy to grab it. But even without the 10 off 70, I would have just had a nice little freebie, a 94 cent moneymaker, which would have been awesome. But super, super happy with how this turned out. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. And I'm going to see you again soon. Bye.